In this video, we will be covering how to use the Accessibility Checker that is built into Microsoft Word on a Windows machine. The Accessibility Checker does a quick look over your document to see what barriers might pop up. Before we get more into that, let's talk about how to run the Accessibility Checker. There are multiple ways to do this, but we will focus on two in this video. The first option is with a mouse, and the other option is with just a keyboard. So let's start with the mouse directions. You'll go up to the left-hand corner and type on, or tap on File, and then on the right hand side under the info tab there's going to be three buttons you want the middle one which is inspect document tap on that and you'll get a drop down menu with three options you want the middle one for check accessibility this will pop up a window pane on the right side of your screen with the results of the checker So that again will be tap on file on the right hand side under info is inspect document check accessibility. So doing that with keyboard commands, we would actually tap Alt. This will show us what letters or numbers we would press to get into the different ribbons. So the next one would be F for file, I for info, I for inspect document, and A for check accessibility. That combination again is Alt, F, I, I, and A. Each button is pressed independently. So either option gets you to the che accessibility checker pane. It categorizes the barriers into one of three, the f errors, warning, or tips. Errors are what you need to change to make sure your document is accessible. Warnings are things that are worth your time to change because they'll have a big impact, while tips are small changes that do increase accessibility but are not as um, large impact. So the wonderful thing is anything that pops up in here, you can actually press on the error and if you scroll down to the bottom of that pane, it'll tell you why you should fix it and the steps to actually fix it. So you can do this for every single one until you get it fixed the way you want. There are some things it cannot check for, mainly color contrast. The gray text up here did not appear on the sidebar. So while it can't do everything, it is a wonderful first step, especially uh, regarding larger barriers. Thanks.